I'm going to talk about human papillomavirus, HPV. Now this is the name given to a common group of viruses. They don't cause problems in most people, however they can lead to genital warts or some cancers. HPV itself sometimes doesn't cause any symptoms, so you may not even know you have it. However, sometimes HPV can cause painless lumps in the genital areas. There are many different types of HPV. They can live in your mouth, your throat, and genital areas, and they can spread through contact. HPV can sometimes lead to genital warts, or it can also cause abnormal cell changes that may lead to cancer. Cancers that are linked to high-risk HPV include cancer of the cervix, anal cancer, penile cancer, vaginal cancer, vulval cancer, and some head and neck cancer. You may have HPV for years and not know you have it. You don't always have to be sexually active to also have it. HPV testing is part of the cervical screening program. If you're aged between 25 to 64, I would urge you to attend your routine cervical screen. During cervical screening, a small sample of cells are taken from your cervix and tested for human papillomavirus. I've already uploaded some videos on what happens during a smear test and also how to interpret your smear results. I would urge you to look at those. If you're worried about having your smear or not sure why you need a smear then please don't just put it off i would urge you to speak to your doctor or your nurse so we can discuss your concern if you have any questions then please drop them in the comments